In this video, we'll discuss the primary workspace in OpenVSP, namely the menu bar, how to manipulate your model inside the workspace, and some features in the geometry browser. Now in the menu bar, we have access to a number of analyses, model operations, standard views, window operations, clipboard operations like cut, copy, and paste, undo, change, select all, and file operations. Now note, you can save or save as your models, but VSP does not autosave. So it's very important that you save your models regularly. Inside the workspace, we can manipulate our model by dragging the mouse around while clicking, and this orbits the camera. If we right-click and drag, that's a pan or translate operation. If we middle-click and drag forward and back, that's our zoom. Now you can also accomplish this by clicking left and right at the same time and dragging. Or if you don't have a three button mouse or if you happen to be working on a laptop with a trackpad, clicking and moving the mouse around still orbits, alt click and drag is pan, control click is zoom. So that's a couple of different ways that we can manipulate the model inside the VSP workspace. Now notice that as I'm orbiting, it's rotating about the origin in the model, which in this case is here at the nose. There is a way to set this center of rotation elsewhere in the model, but we're going to cover that in a later tutorial. For right now, let's move on to discuss some of the features in the geometry browser, like a set of prepackaged components that you can select and add to your model. Here you've got your model tree or your model hierarchy showing the levels of parent-child relationships inside your model and buttons that allow you to rearrange those components. Clipboard operations, selection operations, and being able to show or hide various components in your model. Surface representation, which we'll cover in more detail later, but know that you have wire, a hidden view, shade, and textures, and also surface line features and set control.